welcome to the project demonstration of food quality monitoring for vegetables and fruits through iot using methane gas sensor and dhp double one in this project we are using uh, wi-fi module lcd display track pcb with a switch and also using uh, buzzer arduino uno and three sensors so here we can see these two are the gas sensors and this one is the Based double one sensor, I will show you. So we pasted here using glue gun. So this is a DSA double one, and these two are the gas sensors, and this is the IR sensor. So IR sensor detect the object. So we are giving the power supply through this uh, adapter. It takes two thirty volts of power supply or input, and it will give five volts of output. That five volts of uh, DC power supply will be given to this. Arduino you know through Arduino you know we can give the power supply to this track PCB so the main aim of this track PCB is uh, equally divide the fibers to the all components like Wi-Fi module LCD display and buzzer and these sensors and will be works on the five volts of this uh, five volts of DC power supply so before on the kit we need to open this one and after that we need to go for the hotspot settings so here we can see the hotspot settings so the project uh, name should be project 6642 without any space without any capital letter and password should be 129 and the ap band so the ap, AP band frequency should be 2.4 gigahertz then only this wifi model will be connected to our phone so now i am owning the power supply so we are using a are uh, two fruits one is a good fruit and another one is a bad fruit so based on that it will be uh, give that uh, this is the fruit is good or bad so the main aim of this uh, project is it will check the fruit or vegetable quality so here we can see one device is connected in the hotspot it is showing so connection management one device is connected and also in the uh, LC lcd we can see reading the data empty the box so it is saying that so we emptied this box and it is take the readings after the readings so here we can see system is ready message and it will show temperature values humidity values and the gas values in a ppm these two are the gas sensors we will measure the So uh, these two sensors will uh, monitor the methane gas. So I will uh, explain how we connected or how we interface with the sensors and you see display to the Arduino Uno. So 2 to 7 is uh, two, 2 pin to uh, pin number 7 this LCD will be uh, interfaced with this one and also the buzzer is connected to the pin number 13. and. Uh, ESP32 uh, Wi-Fi model is connected with the uh, pin number 8 and 9 in a uh, UART communication. So we, you know, we, uh, you know, UART communication means universal asynchronous receiver and transmitter communication. So we will connect that uh, based on that UART communication. We will inter interface this Wi-Fi model to our Arduino Uno. After that, uh, we can see the two gas sensors are interfaced with the pin number uh, A1, A0, A1. So it will read the values and also we interface this uh, IR sensor with the pin number 2 and the switch so this uh, here we can see the switch so if we select based on uh, for this one and this one so this is the vegetable uh, if we uh, press uh, if we give vegetable in this box we need to switch this as a vegetable mode if we give a fruit in this box then we need to switch on this as a fruit mode so now we will go to the uh, another app so we need to install network analyzer so here we can see network analyzer so one device is connected to our hotspot right so that hotspot ip address have to find v so the network analyzer home interface like this we need to go for the LAN scan so LAN scan is a local area network scan so we have to scan so before scan this one 
so you have to see whether the wi-fi is on and off so wi-fi should be in off position so here we can see express inc so we need to go this one and we need to copy this ip address after the ip address so we can we have to go for the juice ssh client this is the juice ssh client so we need to go for the manage connections and we need to add connection and here we can see type type is a telnet and the address copied address have to paste here and the port number is 8080 so now we can see temperature in degrees and humidity air quality and methane values are coming here so now i am placing a normal fruit so now object will be detected by this ir sensor so here we can see it is showing as a fruit and we can change the fruit mode to vegetable mode using this switch so we can see mode as a vegetable now i am placed fruit that's why i am giving this switch as a fruit mode now it is fruit mode so it takes uh, one minute uh, one minute of time period to calculate the or to analyze the data based on these three sensors so it will indicate fruit as a 30 times so the 30 times is equals to 1 minute so after 1 minute or more than 1 uh, minute so it will give a readings whether the fruit is good or bad so we can observe the temperature values so here we can see quality is showing as a good so after that it will again monitor with one second now we are uh, replacing this fruit good fruit with the bad fruit so it will analyze the fruit values so make sure a box will be closed position then only it will analyze the good values so we can see the humidity values are changing when we add a a uh, bad fruit in this box so if the uh, humidity values are in increased then it will give as a bad fruit so we can see the quality is given here so and this will be indicate the temperature and the values and also it will indicate the quality as a good so we can see here this is a good so here we can see this is a past quality good now it will analyzing the so here we can see the quality is not good so here we can see the message also it is showing as a quality is not good so this is uh, actually bad, uh, bad fruit and this one is a good fruit and also it will send a message to this app so here we can see quality is not good so there is not present here quality is not good in this way this product will be works thanks for the watching